Oh, give it a second. Dare we'll get play. there. There we go. <laughs> I'm Nancy Drew. This is my center of operations, my desk. Go ahead and poke around. If you want to know the particulars of how I do what I do, take a look at the book titled How to Be a Detective. It's real helpful, especially if you're new to the mystery solving business. And be sure to check out my scrapbook. I put memorabilia from all my past cases in there. A lot of them were pretty dangerous and at times really scary. But don't say anything about that to my dad, okay? He worries about me enough as it is. And whatever you do, read what's in the file called Case File. That'll tell you all about the mystery I'm about to try to solve. If you think you're ready to dive into that mystery, just click on the plane ticket and you'll be on your way. Hi. Why, well, well, hi. Welcome to Nancy Drew Secrets Can Kill Remastered. So this was the very first Nancy Drew game. I looked it up to find out which one came first. I thought we could just start playing through them. But obviously this is a remastered version because it was the very first game and they no longer sell the very the, the original online. Um, they only have remastered version. So we're playing that. Take two. Shh. <laughs> uh, Mox has decided this game is called Secrets and that's who Drew can kill. Um, and I... Hold on. There's my mouse. And yes, it did save my... my uh, my settings. However, for some reason the text seems to be cutting off at the bottom, so I don't know what's going on with that. But yeah, there's a a mask. A, what Dottie is referring to as a Death Eater mask. Um, yeah, if this is your first time seeing a Nancy Drew game, I've already played two of them. Um, they are available to watch at some point on my YouTube, but at the moment in my collections. If you would like to go back and watch those through. The <laughs> second game that I played which is Secrets of the Old Clock, would only took two streams. So I don't know how long this one's going to be. Um, I hope that you'll join me. I haven't actually got my note my note paper ready. I completely forgot about that. So if you would like to join me in solving this mystery in real time or later, grab yourself a notebook. I've got this watermelon slice notepad because I'm never going to use it otherwise. So we're going to use it for this. A pen, um, some hydration, and if you're like me and you feel half asleep right now, some caffeine. I'm going to open this in just a second. Oh, and I have a magnifying glass, but that's just for fun. <laughs> secrets clocks can kill. That's your true chamber of secrets. Don't worry, Lara's dad worries about Lara in the same manner. Always asking, did you remember to carry your flamethrower in case you get into trouble? Look, he calls it a blowtorch, not a flamethrower. Scrapbook. book. So, hold on. First of Blackwell Manor. I get goosebumps just thinking about this one. It began when a young woman from River Heights. Oh, yes! Oh, that's pretty cool. And the secret of the old clock. Kneeling in 1930 wasn't exactly a piece of cake. I was like, how are they going to do this? Because obviously that's set. it's set in 1930. It's not. Oh, no, hold on. Don't look. Spoilers for the next one. Close that quickly. Ghost Dog of Moon Lake is my in favourite indie band. Actually, a couple of people have told me in the chat that that's their favourite one. But I thought if we just go, instead of going, oh, what's your favourite? Let's play that one next. I thought if we just go back to the beginning, and we can play through them. So I only have a couple of weeks left of this year. Um, I think I'm probably going to take not next week but the week after off so we only really have two weeks to get this done so let's we can always play more tomorrow woof but in ghost <laughs> Mara, you are a ghost dog what are you talking about um this will probably be instructions moving around finding clues inventory icons talking to people in the story. before you can start playing you need to decide whether to play as a junior or senior detective if you choose junior detective You'll get more hints than you will if you're a senior detective, and the puzzles will be a little easier. When you're ready to start playing, just click on the plane tickets and hang on to your hat. Senior has more stars. Well, we played senior last time. Let's see if there's anything else I can do. Okay. Case file. 
A student named Jake Rogers was killed. Oh my god, there's actually a death. Oh, it's so rare to get a death in these games. <laughs> so, so far, the only mysteries we've had were like a fire and somebody who's, who thought they were a werewolf. <gasps> that secret, that's the sort of secret that I would be given if I was playing on junior mode. Sorry. A student named Jake Rogers was killed at the local high school last week. An undercover detective by the name of Beach asked Aunt Eloise if I could if I could go undercover. How old is she in this one? Oh, because she but right, because she's a stu she's a teenager, she could go undercover in the school. Right. That makes more sense. I'm posing as a new student to see what other kids may know about Jake and his untimely end. Okay. Is everybody ready? Has everybody got their notepaper? Oh, my inventory is up there. That's weird. My notes. Observation suspects. My checklist. Check how to be a detective to learn about the game. I've done that. That's done. Oh, I can tick it. Oh, that's cool. That doesn't get ticked automatically. That's kind of fun. I like this. I like this. <laughs> nice. Okay. So if you're ready, if everybody's ready to go, you've got your notepad, you've got your pens, you're ready to type in the chat. Obviously, you can use the. Uh, we will. I will share the puzzles so we can do them together. If uh, you would, you want to tell me you figured out the puzzles. You can use your your channel points to do that. Uh, do you have your phone with a useless web browser installed? <laughs> not in this. Not yet. But oh no, wait. What's that? Presumably, that's what that is. Right. In that case, here we go. I am gonna be the scene. It does have more stars. Oh no, it doesn't have more stars. They're just bigger, so it looks like there's more of them. Yes, and as Mary says, I mean, the regulars in the chat know, but just in case you're new here, we do brainstorm together, we work things out together, but if you figure out the answer or you have already played this game, please don't tell me, because that spoils all of the fun. Senior Detective! Dear Dad, who would have dreamed taking a vacation to visit Aunt Eloise in Florida would result in another case? Seems a student named Jake Rogers was murdered at the high school last week and an undercover police detective wants me to pose as a student to search for any leads at the school. So it's undercover I go. I'm calling this case Secrets Can Kill. Love, Nancy. So in this continuity, has she already done all of the other cases? But Because this is supposed to be the first one, but she's got a book with all the other cases. Oh, it's so confusing. Nancy, I had to close the school library early today, but if you need to do any research for your case, the key to the library is in the safe. Remember not to enter in a wrong combination. Be careful, Aunt Louise. Why is it going to kill me? Let me turn the music down just a smidge. There we go, that's better. Nancy True Extended Universe lore runs deep. There's so many games, though. Oh. Oh. Uh, oh god, that's really hard to read, actually. Pas Pasco Del Mar University and Sigma Phi Kappa Delta Sorority cordially invite you to attend the 25th annual Sigma Phi Kappa Delta Sorority reunion. Sororities always are weird to be out. I've never understood them, really. Pose as a student. You're, what, 80 years old? No! I'm 18! 80, 1, 8. Um, Saturday the 23rd. What? Which month? The Emerald Crest Ballroom. Pasco Del Mar Country Club, Pasco Del Mar, Florida. Florida. Round Robin Golf Tournament starts at 3.30, reception and dinner at 7 o'clock. Dessert and dancing immediately follows. I'm assuming that that is Sigma Phi Kappa Delta. That's what that is. So that's not really something I have to save. But I'm going to write down Sigma Phi Kappa Delta anyway, just in case someone asks me it later and I can't remember what it is. So the Kappa obviously is going to get the chat. Sigma, I, Kappa, Delta. That's done. What this? No, I want the calculator. All right, fine. I can't take the calculator. Guess I'll just have to use my phone. All righty. I'll go that way. Is that the front door? That kind of looks like it would be the front door. Go to the dining room. Showing off my Greek skills. It was an assumption. I could recognize none of them, but they looked like it made sense. Hidden clues are everywhere, says the book. 
The haunted ghost bridge. Strange things are happen have happened on this bridge. Some people have reported hearing screams and cries from below the span. Others have reported ghostly figures looming at the end, and even others have felt a cold tingling sensation throughout their body while crossing. It's a ghost bridge! Sorry. <laughs> No one is certain about the origin of these sightings, but the first documented case of spectral phenomenon occurred around the turn of the last century when a troop of Girl Scouts camped out here. All returned with their hair turned white. None of the frightened campers spoke a word until a year later. A year! <laughs> this book is so shocked! Recognising letters is called reading. <laughs> Baru! <laughs> You're such a troll. I'm a Canadian Greek Scottish. Yes, definitely. I'm not just Scottish. There's a fan theory that Nancy is a vampire since her interactive made her interactive made the Vampire Diaries before the Nancy Drew series. I've heard of the Vampire Diaries game. I watched a um I watched a, a long video by I can never remember her name. What is her name? Hold on. I don't want to be like, oh, by someone I saw online. I want to actually be able to tell you their name because it doesn't make sense otherwise. Vampire. Ah, yes, good. Jenny Nicholson. Jenny Nicholson did a really long video basically explaining the Vampire Diaries. And one of the things she mentioned was the game. So I knew about the game, but I didn't know it was made by her interactive. So that's quite fun. That's quite funny. Also, welcome in, Gooba. Um... I love how shocked the book is. It's like, none of them spoke a word till a year later. A year! At first, the girls just babbled incoherently or screamed or laughed. A psychiatrist specializing in traumatic experience was asked to examine the girls, but the girls would only say one phrase. Follow the X to the spot below. That seems like it's important. I'm writing that down. Thank you so much for that host, Casper. How are you doing? I have phone number. Oh my god, look, I have a phone! Oh, sorry. Every time my cursor uh, goes off the edge of the screen, uh, it vanishes for a second. I'm just trying to make this as full screen as possible so it's a bit easier. Oh my god, I have a picture of myself as my wallpaper. Ooh. Ooh. That's not bubbles, that's just circles. You can't trick me. I'll go for that. Purple, because it's me. Perfect. Camera. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Interesting. Ned, of course. What Drew doing? Nice. What the Drew doing? I'm doing okay. I'm doing good. We're uh, back with another Nancy Drew. This is actually the first game, but this is uh, a remastered version. So it's a bit confusing because he, she's referring to the other cases that she's already done. But they're the games that came later than this one. So it's all a bit all over the place. Well, none of these seem to be. Imp oh, hold on. There we go. During her trip with Maxine, Maggie learned an old hiker's trip. Are Lena and Maggie coming to tea? inquired Carl. No, they've gone to see the bandit's treasure at the Land and Lakes Theatre, replied Anya. Brandy Armstrong is playing the lead. Oh, I once visited Brandy Restaurant in Napa, California. It's called Mamalones. It was magnificent. I ate there, and I got sick on a jellyfish sandwich. What on earth is that going on? I feel like this is all code. This must be code. Sorry, I read ahead. Um... Oh, you should have tried the dog's eye. It was... Please, do not bring this back. I do not need to be reminded of the terrible Cockney rhyming slang <laughs> from Blackmore Manor. I do not need this. <laughs> Please. <laughs> Wait, that's... that's from... Are they all references? Because the barking dog would do well to hold his tongue in that neighbourhood is from the, the secret of the old clock. 
oh, I bet you all of this is ref- all of these are references, and I only get these two because they're the two I've played. Uh, Once in a Blue Moon, that's the Blue Moon, um, that's the next game that I was gonna play. That's the one where you go with the Hardy Boys. Ah, uh, okay, there's a lot of references here that I feel like I'm not gonna appreciate yet. I need something to make this work. Okay, so at some point I'm gonna get a VHS. Ooh. Thanks. Key to the tea lounge. Okay. Oh, it's just towels and stuff. Cool, cool. Okay. Well, I guess from that letter that we found that I'm supposed to go to the library and do research, so I guess I have to go to the... Oh! Well, I mean, it said not to enter a wrong code, but I'm assuming it's seg... S sigma? <laughs> sigma Phi Kappa Delta. We drop our first sneaky save. Okay. Sigma Phi Kappa Delta. Easy enough. Oh! Oh, a slide puzzle. I feel like there's gonna be a lot, like I said, there's gonna be a lot of references that I don't get and are gonna be completely lost on me. So I feel like we may have to come back and play this game again. I'm not very good at slide puzzles. I'm not good at thinking ahead. But I believe... that that should be down at the bottom. Oh no, wait. That's the end of her... her eyes. And that's her shoulder. So the mirror's on the left-hand side of the picture, and the robber is on the right-hand side. Okay. Nope. Means this pink line. All the way over here. I believe this one's the top piece. I'm having fun. Okay, I don't. I might not. I might not be doing this quickly, but I'm. I'm still having fun. Hey, that, and then this one. Oh, but what's at the bottom then? Oh, that must be the gap. That must be where the gap stays. Uh, yeah, I struggle with slide puzzles. That's why I'm prefacing this by being like, I am not good at this. Do not get mad at me. <laughs> so I think... Oh, I need to swap these two pieces around. Hold on. goes here oh that must be where her like yeah that's her hand so that goes there this piece goes here so I need to somehow get that okay okay we're getting somewhere 
because I can just shift these all up around by one now. to still get these guys up there. I've got not one, not Drew. Wait, no, actually it is Drew. <laughs> I mean, you guys know that I slide puzzles are like the bane of my existence in um oh I need to get those two the other way around oh so close so bad at this but slide puzzles are like the bane of my existence in uh Breath of Layton. Computer name Louis Eloise Drew password O Wise Elder. Is that a is that an acronym of your own name? Anagram even not acronym. Is that an anagram of your own name? O Wise Elder. It is. Do I get to keep that? Oh my god! I don't even get to keep that. Do I have to remember that? Wait, is it, am I gonna write it down in my book? Yes. Good. Is there anything else in there? Ah, there's the key. Well, I think that's everything. Okay, I can't actually- What? I accidentally closed it. I can't go out that- down that corridor. Okay, gotcha. Well, time to leave, I guess. Oh. Nancy Drew, Detective Beach here. How are you? Good, and yourself? Frustrated, Nancy. I need some leads, and you're my man. Uh, well, woman, teen, student, whatever. I'll be at Maxine's diner. Come see me when you've found out anything. All contact should be through me. Can do. So what's our cover? Our what? Um, our cover. Who should I say you are if anyone sees us and asks? Oh, right. Uh, I'll be your uncle. Uncle Steve. I gotta go now. If you need anything else, come see me at Maxine's. I'm wearing glasses and a green striped shirt. Okay. So. How the W's are like little bats. <laughs> little bats. Um, so we've got a classic. Uh, oh my god. Beautiful. I love it. We've got a classic um, murder she wrote scenario here where the. Uh, the detective, the actual police are completely useless. Perfect. Love that. Uh, thank you for the hydrate, Gooba. And one for yourself, everybody. And one needs to hydrate, not just me. God, it's spooky here. Oh, it's really spooky. They're going proper spooky vibes. Okay. Where is the library? Ah, this way. Right next to the gym. This is huge. Is this what American high schools look like? Oh, right, yeah, I have a key. I was like, why is the door not opening? Okay, this is getting a bit frustrating. I've got it in windowed mode to make it easier to capture it, but it's just... Hey, thank you so much for that host, Gooba. I really appreciate it. Okay. Spooky. So basically, what I'm gathering from this, I'm just, ooh, that's gonna come in handy. What I'm gathering from this is that um, Eloise is the librarian at this school. Nancy has been spending like the holidays or the weekend with her or whatever, and 
she's gone. There's been a murder at the school and we need someone to go undercover to find answers so you can do it because we know that you like solving crimes. Like what? <laughs> I'm going to be back soon but I have to go run some errands. Happy I could watch for a bit. Okay, Dottie. Good luck with your errands. Don't worry about if you can't get back and watch the stream before I go offline. But I hope everything goes well for you and your errands go quickly. Thank you so much for being here. And thank you again for that resub. Can I click on anything? Okay, it says Jake was here on the book. Why are mercury and bromine in red? Anyway. Yes, yes, very sad. Anyway. Ah, the computers. Perfect. That's what I need. No? Oh, those are study desks. They're not computers. Where is the computer then? Ah, over there. Oh, and it's back to me spooky again. Can I use the computer yet? Catalog search. They don't have any books on Goose's. That's a shame. Right, I've clearly got to find a starting point. Maybe I should go and talk to the guy at the diner? I don't know, I kind of thought that... I might be able to find something here first. Ooh! Marie Antoinette. Sometimes I'm like, are they just throwing me a curveball or is this actually going to be important? Right, let's read it anyway. Born in Vienna, Austria on November the 2nd, 1755. She was the youngest daughter of Francis I and Maria Theresa, Emperor and Empress of the Holy Roman Empire. In, 17 century, in 1770, as a young teenager, she was obliged to wed Louis XVI, I had to think about that, of France to symbolise an alliance between France and her parents' dynasty, the Habsburgs the Habsburgs of Austria. Four years later, Marie Antoinette became Queen of France when her husband was crowned King Louis the 16th. Oh, right, that was before. Yeah, okay. As queen, her lavish lifestyle made her unpopular. While the commoners stood in bread lines praying for food, they cursed the queen who was living so comfortably in her grand palace. I swear to God, if they, if they do the let them eat cake line. The people's discontent grew and grew until a full-scale revolution broke out in 1789. In, 19, in 1791, not 1971, bit of a jump, it looked like the monarchy would not survive and Marie sought assistance from other European rulers. It was arranged for the king and queen of Par to escape Paris on the night of June the 20th. The revolutionary forces apprehended the royal couple at Varennes on June 25th and escorted them back to Paris as prisoners. Okay, that seems really random. That we were able to... Oh, are we going to get Kanji? Can I take a picture? <gasps> I can. Fantastic. Cool. That way I don't have to try and write everything down. I knew, I know like one of these. That's not true. I knew fish, but I wouldn't have been able to write it for you. And I knew water. That's it. It's kanji, not kanji. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, Braille as well. Oh, I st oh no, I started learning Morse code, not Braille, it's different. But it's a lot of dots. You know, two more than me. Well, I wouldn't have been able, I can, I can recognize the one for meat because for some reason, that's like the first one you get taught on. Hold on, not Duolingo, it was Memrise. Before Duolingo had Japanese, I was using a different app. And the first few like kanji that you get taught because I could, I think it's, oh, is it hiragana or katakana that I can, I can recognize? I can recognize one of the alphabets and then they started teaching you kanji and that's, um, it was like water and like home and meat. For some reason, those were like the three it showed you first. I was like, okay. But this was a few years ago now. I've started learning um, Morse code instead. Because I just want to be a real life Nancy Drew, okay? <laughs> okay? I've always wanted to be a detective. Okay, I can take four, 30 pictures. I think if I just like fill up my... This way I don't need to take actual physical notes anymore. Which is half the fun, but... 
Yeah, this is where we can change our settings. I've already changed the background of her phone. Okay. So I should probably be looking if I can actually click on any of these books. Steroid. Uh, I, I'm calling it now. Jake was abusing steroids. Anabolat anabolic steroids are drugs used to enhance athletic performance and build muscle mass. They are virtually all derivatives of the testosterone or substances which promote the overproduction of testosterone in primates. In America, anabolic steroids are classed as a controlled substance and possessions of even a small amount of hec hectanol or excuse me, human growth hormone can land a dealer in jail. Yet steroid has use has doubled and redoubled in America fitness scene over the last 20 years. What's the attraction? Why would a star amateur or professional athlete risk jail time for possession? Because many people think that they can get a little bit of extra performance if they take the stuff. Peer pressure among college and even high school athletic teams is another reason. If everyone on the team is taking the drugs, you have to as well to keep up because the early gains from anabolic steroid use are awesome, but there's no shortcuts to athletic excellence. The physiological sides are terrible, liver damage, heart disease and impotence are just a few problems, the lower body fat levels encountered with he in countered with heavy steroid use are unhealthy. In addition, though, anabolic ster anabolic oh my god, I cannot say anabolic. Anabolic steroids grow at a fast rate. They don't change the composition of the connective tissue nor the heaviness of the bones. Thus, while the muscles are stronger, the support system for them is not. So injury is often a result. Ah, okay, okay, and that's the only thing I can click on. So that's going to be useful as well. See, this is how these games work. You find out all the clues because uh, something is going to come in useful. What on earth is that? Are these Nancy Drew fan arts? Oh my god, they are! Can you imagine being one of the people who got your fan art in this remastered game? That's pretty neat. Oh, I wish I'd played the others now. I feel like I've missed out on a... on something exciting because, you know, I've, I've not got the history behind it when this probably came out and everyone was like... Oh yeah, all these references that I get. Okay, I'm just gonna go upstairs and check if there's anything that I've missed. I go to the, the diner and the guy's like, did you find anything out? And I'm like, hmm. there was a really conveniently placed um, book about steroids. Don't do drugs, kids. Captain America sitting down on the back of his chair. So, you've been taking steroids. Oh, uh, I just love that as a meme format. It's so good. Anabolic second wife to Henry VIII. You know that one of the wives of Henry VIII did like all sorts of amazing stuff about um, women's rights. And I can't remember any of the examples. Oh, I can go down this one. What? What the? Was that me? Did I do that? Was that in the game? Was that you guys? Did you make that happen? Somebody ran out the door with a with a book, set the alarm off. More fan art. I love it. Okay, so the door locks every time. Good to know. Was that me? Was it me? Am I the drama? Crystal Skulls, the, book, the uh, Indiana Jones movie that we never talk about. One of the most ancient and widespread legends known to humankind can be summed up thusly. Scattered over the earth are 13 humanoid skulls carved out of pure crystal. At some point in the future, fate will bring the 13 skulls together and they will speak. Who says, who says this? What? Imparting wisdom that will save the human race from annihilation and usher in a golden era of peace and enlightenment. There are several versions of this legend. In one, the skulls were created by Mayans, Incans, or Aztecs, and collectively form a repository of information detailing how and why humans came to be. Another legend credits their creation to the extraterrestrials who seeded the Earth with the human race and left the skulls behind to explain their actions at some point in the future. Yet another contends that the skulls are ancient in origin, but more important, that each skull is somehow magical in and of itself. The distinctive gifts that they offer... I lost track. I lost my 
they offer their owners repu reputedly includes precognition, clairvoyance, telekinesis, and of course immortality. Some variations combine all of the above. What is both indisputable and it I swear to god I thought that was Farquad from Shrek. <laughs> What is both indisputable and intriguing about the general legend and its smaller colourful variations is that several mysteries, mysterious crystal skulls have indeed been discovered in the past millennium, turning up in all corners of the earth. What follows is an examination of everything that is currently known about these skulls in hopes of separating the facts of their existence from the fantasies of human imagination. So is this probably not necessarily relevant? I Taswick! Oh my gosh, there's so many cute, excitable emotes. I love them. In that case, I'm not going to read up on this until it comes relevant later. But yeah, like I said, I kind of feel like I've missed, I'm have missed. i missing out because I'm coming across all these things that are... Oh no, that's where it came from. There are references that I'm not necessarily going to get because I've only played two Nancy Drew games. Let's, uh, let's head to the diner because I think... Hmm. Well, it I still didn't find the a computer in here that I can use. Wait, what was that? Ooh! I got a coin. That's exciting. Hmm. I wanna go to this computer. I don't think I can. I'm assuming I can maybe stand here later when there's somebody at the reference desk. Well, I'll have to do it later. In that case, let's get out of this school. Oh, what was that? Oh, is it just a random... It's not actually important. It's just somebody's dropped a book. Okay. There's a lot of places to go in this school, so I am just going to go where I need to be. For actual real life context, the crystal skulls were invented by Europeans in the 1800s and have zero connection to Central South America, America history or mythology. Is that true? Hello, Mahela. Welcome in. Good morning to you too. Diner. I barely knew her. Ha ha ha. Ooh, video games. Bet there are gonna be references too. Aw. Ooh, this one. Oh no, I spent my coin! Well, I might make the most of it. Ahoy, matey! Your be job be to scrub our barnacle ridden decks by blasting them out of the way with your magic. Oh, is it a. It's a block blah breaker or whatever you call it. There's lots of different names for it. So. In reference to that Gooba, I um, I picked Senior Detective when we played my, my first game that I played, which was uh, Blackboard Manor. I picked Senior Detective because I thought, you know, the chat. We've got, I've got the chat. We can always work on things together, and I'm making notes anyway. And then the entire way through, I kept saying that I regretted it, and I wish I had a checklist because I kept getting stuck. But now I've just committed to the bit. We're just we're just committing to doing Senior Detective every time now because I've got you guys, I've got notes, so we can work it out together. You guys are my checklist. They were crafted in Germany from quartz imported from South America. They're basically just tourists. Is that true? Oh, that's really interesting. See, there you go. That is a fun fact. Time to play Pong. <laughs> Let's play Pong. Scrubbing a chest increases your paddle size. Scrubbing a mine decreases your paddle size. Scrubbing an anemone slows down the magic ball and scrubbing a warp ball speeds it up. Oh! Oh my god. Oh, so fast! And I only have one coin, so I've got to make the most of this. Oh my god. Ah! Oh! oh, that was so good, though! <laughs> How amazing was that though? I, I'm never gonna get- wait. I can still go? Oh I get seven balls! Oh I thought I'd only get one shot. Oh nice, okay. 
Oh, this one's much slower. I think it's because I hit it at an angle right at the start and it sped it up. Oh! That froze! That's not fair. I used to have um, a game exactly like this on my computer as a kid, but I can't remember what it was called. Like, it was like Breakaway, but oh, no, I don't think it was Breakaway because I think that's the original. Come on, there's one left. I'm never going to get that row like that again. Nazi Drew is here to solve a literal murder for once. Okay. And she's just like, no, I'm just going to play Barnacle Blast all day. Oh, yes. Look at that. I really don't want to hit that whirlpool because it's going to speed the ball up, but... We're gonna end up hitting it anyway. No! No! I don't want it to go faster! Thought you could trick me like that haha <laughs> apologies i'm not reading the chat right now there's a lot of concentration happening gotta angle this thing come on yes so hard once it gets to the last one or two but luckily there's no time limit <laughs> Imagine. Oh no, I'm getting rid of I can't see! I'm sorry. Okay, there we go. Hey, Gohan! Thank you so much for that raid. How are you doing? What were you up to? Welcome in. It's so nice. Thank you again for that raid. We got a raid yesterday as well. I mean, he's dead, so as no one, no one pisses off the murderer, we're fine. I mean, no one's gonna- unless, unless the murderer has the top score in this, and I'm gonna beat his top score, and then he comes after me. That could be a thing. That could be a problem. Thank you so much for that clip, serotonin. I love it. Who cares about murder when you're busy killing it at gaming? Exactly. You know, it's just me when I put the game on pause and I'm like just chatting and it's like, Lara, you're supposed to be solving a murder right now. And I'm like, look, I'm having fun. I'm living my best life. Thank you so much for the raid. How are you doing? What were you up to today? It's so good to have you. We are playing Nancy Drew, um, Secrets Can Kill. Not secrets can kill Nancy Drew, it's a very clear distinction. I gotta be careful because if I accidentally click and I'm under here and I click one of these icons, I'm probably gonna mess the game up. You doing okay? Good to hear. I was kind of hoping to get that action going on. Like those ads sometimes that you get on like TikTok or YouTube that are just for games like this. But they do it in like ah, they do it in such a satisfying way. They like get it and it gets all of them. Is that being paid to solve this one? Because if not, it's on your time. Well, I don't know. They didn't. They haven't mentioned any financial compensation, but you know, maybe, maybe they're planning on it. But I don't. Do they ever pay me? I don't think they ever pay me. At least not the ones I've done so far. I just do it for funsies. Oh yes, I got enough to get an extra, an extra um, try, an extra life, getting a life. Still one of my favorite parts of Scott Pilgrim. Ooh. Also, I if anyone finds like a cool Nancy Drew shirt, I will definitely ask her for Christmas because there's a bunch. <laughs> I've got a few people who are like, "What do you want for Christmas?" And I'm like. No idea, but I will take a Nazi Drew shirt. Oh, come on, can I get this? Right, so if I want it to get into the, into that spiral, I probably need to hit it at a very specific angle that I'm probably not gonna get from the first try. So let's, nah, I couldn't do it. I tried, she tried, but she did not succeed. I have not played this one before. I have played Blackmore Manor and I have played Secret of the Old Clock. Wait, did that? Oh no, that made my ball smaller. Okay, I was worried that made my paddle smaller, but it's okay. Um, but I thought, because I've played a couple of them, I thought we'd go back and we'd start at the beginning. 
I don't know how long this one's gonna take. Uh, Secret of the Old Clock only took me two streams. Um, and if this one takes me any more than two streams, which it will at this rate because I'm standing here playing um, Barnacle Blast instead of, you know, solving a murder, um, then we'll probably play it into next year. I'm also looking to play... Um, oh, I slowed down the ball. I forgot that. I was like, why is this taking so long? Um, other detective games. So I'm maybe going to... There's a there's a Hercule, Hercule Poirot. No, is it Hercule Poirot? I think it is. Uh, game that I was looking at on Steam. And I was considering getting that and streaming that. And there's also like a bunch of Sherlock Holmes games. And I thought it could be fun to just do loads of them. Oh, I was so close. Yeah, a lot of people said to me that um, Blackmore Manor was their favorite while I was playing it. They would come into the chat and be like, oh my God, you're playing Blackmore Manor. This is my favorite game. And I'm like, for good reason, it's pretty good. I really, really enjoyed it, which is what made me want to play more. Secret, excuse me, Secret of the Old Clock was good, but it wasn't as good. So I'm hoping that I get that like high again from this one or another one we play. Nancy lives off dad money and never brings any cash. She's, I'm pretty sure she's still in school. <laughs> Don't think she needs to, that's not true. She she got money from the, um, the paper round, the telegrams that she did in the last game, so. I just give mugs to people. Everybody loves mugs. <laughs> Find me a Nancy Drew. Actually, no, there is there is actually Nancy Drew merch, like official her interactive merch. I found it on their um on their website when I was looking for the downloads. Whoa, whoa, whoa! I forgot how fast it's supposed to be. Oh god, help! Too fast. Panic, panic. Oh, it caught on the edge. I watched a stream the other day and someone hated it and I was like, what? Everyone can have taste. How dare they? Ah! Ah! No! Oh, I'm not doing so well on this level. I don't think it's going faster. I think I'm just not... My brain isn't going fast enough. More caffeine. You guys just want to watch me play um, Barnacle Blast? for the rest of the day. Uh! When the music reloads, it like freezes for like a split second, but it means I can't move the paddle. Trick, do you see that trick shot I did that was totally intentional? You like whack it with the corner. It like goes off at a nice angle. Come on, yes! Is that what you want? If yes, then sure. Oh, Luca, you're so sweet. You're like, just do whatever makes you happy. Also, someone else was like, um, so someone in the chat just said the music in this uh, diner just goes so hard. Wait, does that spell something? Does that spell bond? B O N D. Bond. Like, James Bond. <laughs> Unless it's supposed to be like, Eight zero eighty Nancy Drew. Wait, eighty years of Nancy Drew. Is that what it says? My boyfriend got me a T-shirt from her interactive Teespring store, and sadly the graphic peeled off. Oh no! Well, no one would do that then. Nancy Bond, the name Bond. Nancy Bond. The reasoning was the puzzles were too hard, and I was like, but that's why you have me. I think maybe if I wasn't already like a puzzle streamer and I wasn't really into puzzles as a person, I might not find that fun. But no, that oh I missed it. That was serotonin. Ugh, tasty. Well when did Nazi Drew Ah I was so close! Oh that's so annoying. Stop talking while you're playing Barnacle Blast. What? <laughs> I'm sorry, I didn't mean to shout that. What? What? Like a little duck. Meh. I'm moving my microphone so it's not so loud. Oh, that's annoying. I've lost three lives on this one level because it's not quite been where I expected it to be. Oh no, I put the microphone in the way. Okay, there we go. Sorry if there was like a little bump there as I moved it. This is the kind of high-octane fun you expect from 
a Nancy Drew streamer. I'm not a Nancy Drew streamer, but I am a puzzle streamer. What? I just know it's not Atient. <laughs> That's true. Did you guys see? I'm sure if you're a Nancy Drew fan, you've seen the, uh, the remaster that somebody made of. Oh, which one is it? It's one of the. Uh, wait. S C K. These clues. These are all clues. Um. That somebody made of one of the games. It's like a fan made remaster. No, don't hit the whirlpools. Yes. Um, no, no! I don't want the ball to get faster! No! <laughs> oh god! Oh, the panic is real. The panic is real. If I die, it'll go back to its normal speed. Oh god. Go back to its normal speed, right? It does good. I think I'm gonna play that, but I haven't played the old one, so I don't know if it's worth it. I feel like sometimes you've got to suffer through like the old versions of things, who really appreciate the remasters, and get the in jokes. Like this one, there's a lot of in jokes that I had didn't get. I only got two of them because they're the games I have played. Come on. Don't hit the whirlpools, it hits every whirlpool. Look, that is my life, okay? <laughs> that is just how I play games. You're making burger for breakfast? Good on you. The goose is up on the shelf and he's looking down on you in with with um with joy in his eyes. In his sock eyes. Because <laughs> he doesn't have like any pupils, they're just black. Um I think there's an award for getting through a certain number of levels. Well, let's go. Let's see how many we can get through. This is level eight. I want to try and get to level 10. But I was going to say, but I keep losing the balls. <laughs> okay. Okay. Look, I'm rolling up my sleeves. This is real, real intense hours now. We're going to do it. Eyes on the prize, girl. <laughs> no! No! <laughs> Damn! Okay. Do I else feel hot? It's getting hot in here. <laughs> okay. <sighs> ah! I keep moving too far and think. I'm sorry, okay. This is the last chance. This is our last chance saloon. I'm so glad it didn't freeze and the music changed there. Oh my god, there's so many whirlpools on this one! <laughs> no! I think it's probably like 10 levels. I feel like that's probably- Oh, thank you! Oh, thank thank you, thank you. I'll take the applause, I'll take the cheering. Thank you very much. Um, Every streamer has that one game that makes them break and yours is Barnacle Blast. 
we know what uh we know what mine is if you're a if you're a long time viewer of the channel you know what my game is that made me break starts with a c and ends in angels and it's not changels <laughs> it's charlie's angels back in uh 2020 wow it was only last year it feels like so much longer ago than that i went through a, uh, a bout of playing yes for the gamecube and playstation 2 i went through a bout of playing movie games so tie-in games that were based on films and I stopped for a myriad of reasons, one of which was it took so long to try and get all the games working that I would end up having to like spend an entire day doing it that I couldn't stream on and it was just really stressful, so I stopped doing it because it was too much work. But the other reason I stopped doing it was because Charlie's Angels broke me. And I don't think I can go back. And I've tried going back. And I couldn't do it. The Timed Races and Jack and Daxter. There's some pretty bad games. I have played some pretty bad games, but usually there's enough, like, it does look like a crab <laughs> or a heart, either one. Um, usually there's enough, like, meme potential that I can keep it going. <laughs> no, 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 no. Oh my God, I still have another one. I got one. <laughs> that was horrible. That was so horrible. Uh, um, like the B movie game is also dreadful, but it was funny enough that I could get through it. But Charlie's Angels was not funny enough that I could get through it. I just couldn't beat it, and I got mad. And it's sometimes I get genuinely mad on the stream, and it's not funny anymore. Cause you know when people get mad on streams or on videos on YouTube at a game and it's funny because they're doing it comedically and you can tell they're annoyed but it's like they're playing it up i got actually genuinely angry and i could tell that it was just being a bad vibe in the chat and i was like i'm gonna have to stop i can't do this anymore because i'm just getting genuinely cross and that's not fun for anybody <laughs> you would know i think for those who were there at the time they probably can confirm it wasn't nice to be in the chat while i was like that I don't have a very bad temper, usually. When I get angry, I get angry. <laughs> we don't want that. Cause I'm, I'm, I like to be chill and soft vibes. I don't like to be mad. Okay, she says, and she's gonna get, so, I'm gonna get so mad if I die immediately on this. Joe's just come home. He's not allowed to come in while I'm doing this. Cause I will get distracted and then I will cry. hear him outside the door. No, 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 no! Oh God, it slowed down again. Uh, just a sec. <laughs> ah! <laughs> and now a welcome break from Joe. Come in. <laughs> okay. Let's play Barnacle Bob. You're playing Barnacle Blast? <laughs> Just a mini game in Nancy Drew. Oh no. Okay. Ah. <laughs> Switch back to Nancy Drew. Do I, should I have another go? I'll come and open a donut shop. I'll come home and I'll open a donut shop. But yeah, they have, um, well, the actual, hold on. Sorry to continue the conversation because we weren't actually. Did I take pictures of them? Yes, I did. So the coffee shop is also like a restaurant. Um, why are there cows in this song? So this is what I had last time I was there. It's the sausage, it's called the sausage stack. It's a sausage patty, a fried egg, and I think there's and cheese, and it's in a croissant roll. So it's like croissant, but it's made into the shape of like a bun. It's really nice. If you ever come here, I'll take you there. Let <laughs> you try it. <laughs> okay. Oh my god. What? Oh my god, I got one more go? No. Don't. I wouldn't do that, Maru. <laughs> Turn safe search. No, safe search on! 
god, it slowed it down. It's actually better for me that it's slowed down. It's so much easier to deal with. Brave soul doing God's work. Come on. Okay. I have one life to get through this level. I, it's probably 10 levels, right? That makes sense that they would give you, they would be like, get 10 levels on this because it's a nice round number. Divisible by five and one. Wait, obviously, if it's divisible by five and ten. Stupid thing to say. Oh my god. I think I was trying to go for five and two, but my brain was like, it's divisible by one. Okay, look, I don't do... I don't do maths, okay? I'm I'm a words person. I like... I mean, I'm not good at words either, but I like riddles rather than maths. Oh! Holy moly! Oh! <laughs> so close! I really thought I was gonna make that! Hey, there was more to that sentence. Don't just quote that part. That's so mean. Oh, okay. Does it get faster? Is it building up momentum? No! I was this close! I should probably go and solve the murder now, you know? <laughs> Obviously. Oh, do I have to put money in? I don't have enough money. Alright, when we get some money, I'm gonna put in and um, play goose. He's <laughs> gonna die around. Oh. <laughs> I'm sorry. I mean, thank you for. I appreciate that you're, uh, you're, f you're really feeling me on this. Ooh. Do they have any? They have burgers! Fantastic. Ooh, what's that mean? XER3. That looks like it's been added later. Oh, there's there's code. I've just noticed the word the letters are colored in. I'm going to write them out. It may be absolutely nothing, but Hmm, okay, hold on. We've got Green letters, red letters, blue letters, and pink letters. Cash cow. Okay, I'm writing these out because they might be useful later. Goose and burger. It's heaven. It's the place for us, guys. It's our it's our home. Right, the green letters are J O U and A. Yow. Oh no, there's an R as well. Dora. I missed anything. You're like, oh no, it's an N. J O U R N A L. Journal. Journal. Okay, journal. There we go. That makes more sense. The red letters are H I S is. The blue letters are I. S M Y and the pink letters are cash cow. So the letters we the words are journal his is my cash cow. I hope it's a secret dad joke, me too. Okay. I do like how well, one of the things I really enjoyed about Blackmore Manor is that when we got to the end and I went back and I looked at Jane's book or like we'd solved almost everything and I looked at Jane's book again and I was like, I now understand what all of these mean and I can understand the different references. But when you first get it, you're like, this looks like a bunch of nonsense. 
but then, you know, I worked it out. Uncle Steve! Nancy! Why, I haven't seen you since... Uh, He's a great undercover uh, For a long cop. time. <laughs> How's your... Aunt. Aunt Eloise. Oh, she's fine. And Dad says hello. You're staying with your aunt, right? Yes. So, uh, what do you got for me? This is going to be confusing. Well, I was hoping you could His debrief me on the investigation. Yeah. Oh, sure, sure, sure. I'm just a bit... Well, my undercover assignments are usually not so... Suburban. He's complaining. I understand. The victim was a senior named Jake Rogers. As usual, none of the family, teachers, or students know about any enemies he may have had. As usual. Nothing came up from searching his home, computer, cell phone, or locker. His bank records tell a different story. He had a fairly large savings account and a lot of cash deposits. We suspect he was involved in something shady. Drugs, gambling, or blackmail. That's where you fit in. Talk to the students and see blackmail. what you can find out. <laughs> We think he might have kept information about his activities in a notebook or journal. So keep a lookout for anything like that. This anything journal is else? my cash cow. Okay, so. Neapolitan. <laughs> oh my god, I can't see the word Napoleon. I keep trying to say Neapolitan. Napoleon Dynamite has an age today. I know, he looks great, doesn't he? Um, so I've just realized I've resized. So I've, I've resized this on my screen so that it's as big as I can make it. And I've realized that I've actually stretched this poor man. He's not actually, doesn't actually look this wide. There we go. That's, that's better. I stretched it too much. Ice cream on the mind. Well, I'm in a diner, you know, you gotta get like an ice cream sundae. Um, I couldn't figure out who I thought he looked like. I don't know if it was Napoleon Dynamite, but when I saw him, I was like, he looks like someone. He's also terrible at being an undercover cop. He immediately almost broke character. Bye bye. God's sake. Goodbye. Like I'm really not good at lying, but at least I feel like if I was playing a character, I could do it decently. Also, do you have a, do you have a quarter so I can put the goose song on? Because I want to know what it what it is. Jump out the window. Um. Wait, where's the entrance? Oh. Here. <laughs> That's why I couldn't find it. Okay, Should we go home. Have a look at our journal. Hmm. All right, so I clearly still need to find something at the school that I've missed. So much stuff here. I kind of don't want to go ever go all over the place, but let's try. If there's anything we can do, like go in any of the student union. That said, co homecoming. Because <laughs> I thought that was a C and I thought it was co homecoming. <laughs> oh no. Enchantment under the stars. Excuse me, I believe it's supposed to be the under the sea dance. Have you not seen Back to the Future? Is that a manatee? <gasps> Money! I can play the song in the jukebox. Hi, I'm Connie. You're not from around here, are you? Usually, what are you doing in our school? Usually, Paseo High is really quiet and boring. Lately, it's been totally out of control. Is it that obvious I'm not from around here? And I'm a school I monitor, so I have coming. to notice these things. <laughs> oh, sorry. Sorry, I'm not even listening to poor Connie. I'm just still laughing at what you're saying in chat. Chrome coming. Is that like, are we talking like Google Chrome or is it like a robot? You're very observant. We girls have to stick together. There are a lot of wolves walking around campus. What do you mean? Literal world? Wolves? You wouldn't want to waste your time with any of the guys at this school. Trust me. They're all a bunch of self-centered jerks. It's okay, I've got I've got a boyfriend, but thanks. Like I mean Nancy as well as me, but Nancy also has a boyfriend. Don't talk all about Jake. Of the too guys? Much. I'm trying not there to be are a few suspicious. Who are cool. Jake Rogers was not one of them. Ooh. I take it Jake wasn't very popular. I avoided him whenever I could. Doesn't mean he's Why not popular. Why is that? Though. Jake was rude, dishonest, self-centered, and manipulative. I gotta go now. Later. And she stays sitting. <laughs> that's how you get. That's how you don't talk to someone you don't want to talk to anymore. You and Nancy have the same boyfriend, maybe. <laughs> that's that just gave me such um. I'm in love with your brother-in-law. Law vibes there. <laughs> You're in love with your own brother, the one in the army. Um, I'm turning that down because that was super loud. Right, it's 
it's louder than me if I'm not if I talk too quietly. Werewolves. It's werewolves again. It's always werewolves. All right. This is this just a random ooh stuff ooh so much stuff. Seniors, all entries in our exhibit 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 must be picked up at the library on Thursday. See Eloise Drew. Oh, she's even got my last name. Ipato Devi. Okay, hold on. Will seal my seal. Sorry, will seal my murderous fate. The hidden videotape. The vi hidden videotape will seal my murderous fate. I couldn't read the word seal, okay? I was trying to make it into sale for some reason. Uh, and we've got another CR1. That's so blatant. Like, it's not difficult to read backwards, even if you're, like, not practiced in it. My mistake was thinking it would start at the bottom and go up, but it's it's just one line at a time. The hidden videotape will see on my murderous fate. I mean, there is a VHS player in the house, so I'm probably going to... Ooh, I know that font. I couldn't tell you what it's called it wasn't on my head, but I've, I've, I've used that font before. Okay, so there's a hidden videotape somewhere. Ooh, there's a person. Talk to that person in a second. Ooh, coin. I like the just don't say no. Wait, just don't say no? Oh, yeah, just don't say no. <laughs> it does say that. Don't listen to the advice on this bulletin board, please. Help wanted. I wonder what the help wanted is. Sign on now for one on one tutoring or group tutoring. The following subjects Math team! Challenge your mind against the best student at Pas Pasco High School. Nah. None of that's relevant to me right now, so. Hi, my name's Nancy Drew. What's your name? A fake name Alta for Naka. Sake. Actually, my first name is much longer than that. But I want to fit in here in America, so I chose Hal as my nickname. Fair. I'm a Japanese exchange student. Why do you think it's easier to have an American name? I want to be part of the culture and succeed in this country. He's so overanimated. <laughs> it's great. So, what's been going on at school lately? A murder was committed here. Everyone is very stressed out. What? <laughs> That's not how you- What? Okay, okay, okay. I'm sorry. Cast your mind back to when you were in high school or of high school age. If somebody who didn't go to your school, I was going to say isn't in uniform, but this is America and they don't wear uniforms. You don't recognize them, comes up to you and just starts asking random questions. I feel like you would be more suspicious or at least be like, Okay, why are you talking to me? Whereas everyone so far has just been like, Hi! Come and talk to me! I don't know who you are. You just wandered in. I've literally wandered into this school off the street. Like, I haven't had to sign in. I haven't, like, I I scanned a little card anywhere. Like, I've done nothing. I've just walked in and they're like, Hello, let me tell you about this murder. This is like every side character in Law and Order. Oh, my character was bloody murdered here a few last night. Right here? What a shame. <laughs> It's so true! It's like, oh, there was a... I mean, at least he sounded sad. A murder was committed here. There. That's what you need. I That's how you do that. it. Some kid named Jake? Oh, yeah. Jake Rogers was a dark soul. He created a lot of trouble. A dark soul? What kind of trouble? Give me the answer Jake right now. Jake was an Ijimeko. In English, you would say a bully. He wasn't very popular. I'm behind in my studies and I must get back to the library. Bye, Nancy. And he stays sitting. My school was huge, I probably wouldn't have noticed. Okay, to be honest, I went to a not particularly large high school and we all wore uniforms. So it would have been very weird for someone. I guess I guess if somebody Nah, I feel like we I would have still recognized if there was somebody new. Maybe if it wasn't in my year, bless so. No, he's Japanese because he used a Japanese word. Oh, I wonder if the fact that that's maybe why we learned the kanji 
I'm not gonna ass I'm not gonna assume that Hal is the murderer, but maybe there's gonna be something later where he like sends a code to someone, and we have to like. figure it out because it's in kanji. Okay, we obviously don't know what word we need yet, but there's a the maintenance room is locked by a braille lock. That seems interesting. Um okay. I don't know if there's going to be stuff I need the coins for later, so I don't really want to use them all on playing the goose song. <laughs> but at the same time I do want to play the goose song. Oh, miscellaneous sport sport notes. <sighs> okay. Nowhere to turn to, nowhere to hide. Let the books in the library be your answer guide. KR1. It's a lot of these. There's a lot of um got KR1, CR1, and XER3 so far. So that's that one. I think they're related to the phrases. Nowhere to turn, nowhere to hide. Let the books in the library be your guide. Hide. Oh, sorry. That someone must hide. Okay, so that's probably backwards. A symbol of kanji worn with great pride. Oh, wow. This is difficult. Reflects big secret that someone must hide. Okay. Just use my phone to flip the wall. I'm not. I thought I'd be a bit worse at this. Um. Okay. And then that one's. Is that one just upside down? Backwards too. He did. Oh, this is harder. It's so much harder to read it like that. Hold on. If I turn my head upside down. He did what it took to make the. Is that a G? The globs? <laughs> I can't be right. I can't figure out what letter that's supposed to be. To make the something. Blech. Even if it wasn't. Oh, that one's really difficult, actually. Hold on. That last one is tricky. Can oh wait, can I rotate it on my phone? Once I've taken the picture, I mean in the game. No, I can't. Okay. Means I'm gonna do it in real life instead. Oh no, I forgot I had auto rotate still turned on from the donut pictures. Okay. He did what it took to make the. Grade? To make the grade? Oh, that took me ages. To make the grade. Even if it. I thought that was wasn't, but I don't think it is. Even if it meant cheating to keep up his charade. He did what it took To make the grade, even if it meant cheating. I'm gonna write that. Oh, there's so many of them. I'm gonna take a picture, but now I know what they say, it'll be a little bit easier next time. Okay, so. Nowhere to turn to, nowhere to hide. Let the books in the library be your answer guide. A symbol of kanji worn with pride. So do we think that maybe Hal isn't Japanese? 
I don't know. I haven't seen. I didn't see any kanji on him. Hmm. Ooh, soda machine. That'll be useful later. I'm sure. Hmm. Okay. can't actually go in the gym, it seems. But why is there an eye test? Eviforzy? Oh, I thought that might actually be something, but maybe it isn't. <laughs> huh. Okay, so I'm thinking... Sorry to interrupt the gameplay, but I've just had a thought that's not related to the game at all. Ooh, coin! Ooh, shiny! Ooh, piece of candy! Um, I'm thinking that maybe I'll finish the stream early because Joe's leaving and I don't. I obviously want to say goodbye to him because he's going to be gone for a few- Ah! Oh my god, there's someone standing there this whole time! Oh, Christ! <laughs> I didn't know there was someone standing there! Jesus! Um, and, uh... And yeah, and then I'll start, I could always start tonight's stream early because it's just me. Because the guys, none of the guys can play with me because they're all going to do stuff. One of them's playing Halo. Joe's obviously not here. And the other one's got university work. They're all so selfish. But no, I'm joking. I'm going to be playing something different, but we could just play more of this. Or I could play this tomorrow. Thinking, I'm still going to play something. But that way I've got time with Joe before he leaves. And then we can come back and play more Nazi Drew. Sound good? A teacher once wrote blah, 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 next to a line, literally looked like that. I asked what it meant and it's, he said illegible as he couldn't read what I had written there. So that's kind of like, is that like proofreading notes? Um, that's something that hasn't come up that I'm surprised about. There's, um, so my mum does proofreading um, sometimes. It's like a little side thing. And um, there's a whole system of like, symbols that they use to indicate things and it's kind of it's it's the sort of thing that would definitely come up in nancy drew at some point like as a system to learn you know um but i don't know, I recognize the squiggle squiggles i don't know if that's means illegible usually but i guess the proofreading she does is typed so it's a bit different i took a picture on my phone and posted the, of this post-it notes and edited it it totally worked take us with you joe whoa a new girl at school do you realize what destiny has brought you today? Yours truly, Hector Sanchez. But you can just call me the Hulk. If I say, how do you know I was new? I bet he's going to say, I know all the babes. I know every babe. <laughs> I'd actually quite, I'd, I quite like his, his character model. He's full of himself, but I like his, I like his character model. Oh God. Oh my God. Except he's completely still except for his blink. He's not moving at all, he's just standing there blinking at me. Can you imagine that happening in real life? He just, he just, I finished my one line of dialogue. And then just sit still and blink. <laughs> he's blinking so, it's such an intentional blink. It's like a, please help me. I'm going to say the Hulk. The Hulk? You are new around here. I play for the manatees. One of the best teams in the state. I leave the others in the dirt, man. Soon it's college ball, and then the pros. I bet, I bet he takes steroids. Look at those! Look at those arms, dude. You work out. He, he's blinking SOS in Morse code. He's not blinking fast enough. He's not blinking fast enough for it to be Morse code. Like I said, I'm gradually learning Morse code. Morse code, but I'm very, I'm not good at remembering them. You look at his, his shirt sideways, it's, it's actually it's actually a code. Or maybe that's why there was 80 ND. That's the 80 for the for the barnacle blast, which I keep trying to call Baja Blast. Oh dear. I think I'll mess, mess with him. Who are the manatees? Paseo Del Mar's mascot is a manatee. Don't tell me you're afraid of a little sea cow. Of course not. I know what to do if I come across a manatee. Yeah, just sneeze and it'll swim away. 
Seriously, the Manatees are a great team at a great school. Everyone is cool, except for a few punks like Jake Rogers. Was everyone Jake stop? Rogers? He's dead. I knew Jake, but I didn't hang out with him. Sorry, can't talk now. I gotta go to practice. Later. Oh, we've reached the end of his dialogue tree. Does he not look way too tall standing in that corner? Um, is this a boyfriend of the American high school variant of me? It's it's the hair, isn't it? That makes you think it's Joe. <laughs> um, I was gonna say something and now I forgot what it was. Oh yeah, I feel like this is a little bit unrealistic because I think if somebody not not only died but like got murdered in your school, I feel like everyone would be less likely to call him a jerk and stuff. Like I feel like I guess they're probably doing that. So I'm suspicious of every character that says he's a bad that he was a bad guy. But I feel like people would be like falling over themselves to be nice about him. I don't know. Maybe not. Which of which end and his rear end? Oh my god! Oh my god! I'm leaving. Oh no! I thought that was the exit. I promise I'm not trying to go in the men's changing room. I thought that was this door. Okay, we've talked to a few people. Is this the way to the library? No, this isn't the way to the library. Oh yes, it is. This is the way to the library. This is the one corridor we haven't gone down. What do we have? Is there any more secret, weird, backwards notes? No, but there is. Okay. Hold on. That doesn't scream coordinates. That's not coordinates. It's not Bible passages. I'm just thinking of things that are normally numbers. It's probably in a book. I'm going to take a picture of this because I'm not going to write the whole thing down. It feels like references in a book, you know, like page, um, paragraph, line, but that's too many numbers. It's usually only three because it's usually, unless it's page, line, word, letter, but then 15 words in a line is probably not right either. But maybe it's not that at all. Maybe I'm thinking too much into this. Vero, <laughs> come to the game. Get involved. Are there any more? Is that the only weird cryptic thing on this board? Okay. Oh, hydration. His he his legs look short, but he looks tall. Unlike me. My legs look lo long, but I look tall. No, I look short. That's what I meant to say. That's me. That's Nancy Drew. Yeah, these are all just... These are all just... um. That's the car from Secret of the Old Clock. These are all fan art. Oh, that must have been so fun. If they, like, got everybody to submit art. Oh, are we going... F oh, yeah, no, I think you might be right. It does... Yeah. But then there's no letters above nine... No, above 20, so that's probably actually it. Okay, hold on. Let me do this real quick. Because I love, I love these, but I'm really bad at mentally doing them. I have to, like, write it out. Again, love word puzzles. Not good at maths puzzles. <laughs> oh wait. Please tell me I'm not the only one who has to sing the alphabet song in their head sometimes. And Z. Have you heard the new alphabet song? Like, the, the new way they're apparently teaching it? They don't go LMNOP like that anymore. Okay, so. One, two. This is why we have a piece of paper, as well as the camera in the game, because we have to do working out. I am impressed um, by those who have played this game before and aren't immediately going, this is how you do it, because I feel like I wouldn't be able to do this. <laughs> okay, C. O, O. L, that's why you said cool, cool. Oh, cool, cool. I understand now. P, O, E, cool pop. Oh, I see you're telling. I thought you were just saying random words, but you're actually telling me. But then, how will kids learn their LMNOP? 
<laughs> so it's it's uh, let's see if I can do it. A B C D E F G H I J K L M O P. No wait. L M N O P Q. So it's the same song. It's the same tune. And then, but they don't do the L M N O P. They just carry on like normally, like one letter at a time. But I can't do it now because my brain's not working. So it's pop and then pop goes the weasel. Oh wait, there's a pop machine. Maybe that's important. Soda. It's going to be soda, isn't it? Oh no, it's not. It's going to be pop. Spot? Spot? Spot. That was one of the drinks in the cabinet. In the in the machine. It was called Spot. Spot. G. Grape? It's gonna be grape, isn't it? It is... Y, D, 3. So it's cool, cool, pop, spot, grape. I know what to do. I know what to do. I've gotta push the buttons. It's not buying a pot, a soda. It's going... It's pushing the buttons. I bet you anything. Oh no, it's pop spot grape. Oh, I did it wrong. Cool, cool, pop, spot, grape. I gave me 85 coins. Wait, was this just all an Easter egg? Literally, because that's the kind of egg that I got in the last game when I did an Easter egg. But now I have 85 coins. I'm on, I'm rich. Time for goose. Let's go back to the, the diner. Let me out of here. I'm going back to the diner. I want to hear the goose song. Oh, it's really quiet now. good time? It's like a Kaylee almost. Oh, you're a bit squiffy. Let me sort your face. <laughs> <laughs> Like a Kaylee. I love it. Oh, I think he keeps thinking it's gonna end. was definitely worth a quarter. There's also a song called Woot. 
I wish I should have done that at the end of the stream. That would have been a perfect end. Anyway, thank you so much. <laughs> yeah, somebody clipped it. Thank you. He, oh snap, that a goose and he dancing. Oh yes, Casper, that was the goose. Um, he doesn't show up that often anymore. Down for the goose. Hi, Sketchy. So I had a pleasant surprise um, just now when I went to check whether or not the DVLA had finally sorted out stuff for me. My license now has a provisional entitlement for County C1 and C&E. Nice. For some reason, my brain went to B&E. I was like, you're now licensed for breaking and entering. Oh, maybe I can talk to this guy. Hey, how much will a quarter buy me? Welcome to Maxine's. I'm Daryl Gray. I don't think I've seen you here before. My name's Nancy Drew. I just moved down here. My then you'll be attending Paseo Del Mar High. I'm your student council president. If there's anything you need, just let me know. Thanks. I might just take you up on that offer. So... What can I do for you? Oh my god, it's Gordon Ramsay, but also a ten potentially a teenager. Not weird at all. Thank you very much. I think that was the best. Um, <laughs> too late, I should have saved before playing that song. <laughs> saved us. I love it because it was like... Why was it called Goose? And it sounded Scottish. It's all we needed. And this place serves burgers. Tell me about the school. Tell me about Paseo Del Mar High. It's a great school. Good teachers, nice students, lots of after-school activities. It's just too bad what happened. See, that's the what right happened? reaction. One of the students was murdered in the school last week. What happened? Someone beat up this guy, Jake Rogers, and then threw him down a flight of stairs. He worked here, but I didn't really know him. He kept he mainly worked to himself. Here. Who did it? No one knows, and the police are keeping pretty clammed up about it. But my resources say they're calling in some special detective. Maybe even the FBI. That's me. I'm the FBI. Sans for... I was gonna say it. <laughs> um, I was gonna say a swear word. I shouldn't. I can't. So, let's go for a non-swear word. Um... What is- it wasn't F, it was the B, but I couldn't- Fancy, beautiful, and intelligent. That's what Nancy is. Fancy Nancy. Chef Ramsay. More like Sham Ramsay. Griff Ramsay. Bird Inspector. <laughs> Fabulous Bird Inspector. What happened? A murder, Nancy. You know this. Did this Jake guy have any enemies? Sure. Doesn't everyone? No. Do, do I have not what, wait, are you gonna say any more? Is that the I end? I should of get back to oh, there work. We go. Nice meeting you, Nancy. Why did he stop for so long? What can you tell me about Hal Tanaka? Hal's an exchange student who's all scholarships and study. He's very intense about becoming a doctor. I'm sus of him. Do you know Connie Watson? Not that well. She keeps to herself a lot. I've always thought there's something mysterious about her. Keep kind of the eyebrows. same way I feel about you. <laughs> yes! You can shoot him down. Thanks for the compliment, but I'm already seeing someone. That's cool. I'm just saying. Not playing. I'm just saying. Not playing. Will that be my reaction too? Doesn't everyone have an enemy? No. <laughs> I mean, I, I, I don't think I have any enemies. I'm pretty... I hope I don't. This is Export Ramsey, adjusted for the American market. <laughs> He's also supposed to be, like, 17. How well do find you out know now if he's a jock. Big guy, big muscles, big dreams. A lot of football scouts have been coming over to watch him play. He must be under a lot of pressure to perform. I have a theory. My first theory. Bye. Of this Take game. care is that well actually i technically already had a theory because i said thing about the kanji but i think that i think that hulk was buying drugs from jake if jake was involved in the steroids because if we had this thing about the steroids i feel like what can i i could go in the kitchen and no one is stopping me this doesn't feel right oh I'm just gonna take a picture of this, don't mind me. We all know that I like- I'm just- Nancy's just breaking and entering. She's got the license to B&E. Am I allergic to anything? Um... 
I'm allergic to nonsense. No, I'm not allergic to anything. <laughs> Thank you for asking. <laughs> Clean up spills. Oh, I read that as like, you know, secrets kill. Or like, loose lips sink ships. Oh, I have taken a ladle. Dear Dari? Daryl. I thought it was an E. I need to break off our date to the Sadie Hawkins dance. I'm very sorry, but something suddenly came up. Wait, was that guy I just spoke to, Daryl? Because in that case, he definitely knows Connie. I can go into the kitchen and no one is stopping me. <laughs> I think that's the right amount of uh, question marks and exclamation marks for that. Clean up dead bodies. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Zordon Ramsey, and Rita Repulsor is finally free to wreak havoc above Angel Grove. I don't recognize. I don't know what you're clipping. I don't know what you're referencing. Sorry. They all did it together. Maybe they did. See, that's the thing. They decided his American counterpart should be younger and more dateable. That sounds about right. Who's? Where's the dating sim for Gordon Ramsey that I I don't want? I was gonna say that I deserve, but I really don't want it. Ah, it was Power Rangers. To say Power Rangers and it makes the game do Hi, a, Nancy. a sting. Oh, what? Bye-bye. Be careful. Really? That's... I don't... I thought you wanted an update when I got information. And I've got information. All right, what's my little... What does my notebook say? Ah. She's been writing that down. Oh, good. I can ask her. According to Detective Beach... The police did not find anything of interest in his locker or home, but they found he had a large savings. Once we look out for a journal that Jake may have kept. They also has hope. Oh, great. So that is... Wait, so I... That is Daryl. I was right. So they were supposed to go to the what dance together. What can I together. do for you? Do you know why Connie broke your date to the Sadie Hawkins dance? No, it was really weird. But what was even weirder is that she took Jake instead of me. Like I said, she's mysterious. Don't say it. Don't say the words Power Rangers because it makes the music do it. Talk to you later. Again. It goes in hard Take and care. it vanishes. It does. It does. Ooh. Ooh. Caught my headphones. There we go. Nope. That's not where the door is. I keep doing that. There we go. There's the door. Okay. These are only locations. I mean, I hope not. But maybe, maybe there's a lot of- ooh! Coin. Not that I need it with my 85 coins. That way. Oh, st oh, it's that. Yeah, I can't go in there yet. Unless that's... What to do with the codes that I'm getting? Hey, Nancy. Need something? How well do you know Daryl Gray? I wish I knew him better. He's the only guy I'd ever consider dating. He's student council president, holds a cool job at a diner called Maxine's, and drives a Seaback X80. Drives a sports Another car and works at a diner? That doesn't compute. Yeah, I don't get it either. Daryl's family was rich and used to throw major parties all the time, but not anymore. Hmm. What's on your necklace, Connie? Why did you break your date with Daryl like to the Sadie Hawkins symbol. dance? <sighs> it's a long story. Did Jake make you break the date? You're asking way too many questions, Nancy. What business is it of yours? Oh boy. She's wearing a necklace with a... It kind of from here looks like it could be a kanji symbol. But all of the things say he about the kanji. Or maybe I don't. Do they? Um, I'm gonna... Do you know how Tanaka... Not very well. He's an exchange student from Japan and a total workaholic. He told me he's trying to get more scholarships for college. Lately, he's been looking really burnt out. I think the pressure's getting to him. Oh, here we go. Hal, Hal Tanaka. That's it, it's his uh, it's Americanized name that he picked when he moved here. Also, anyone notice the can on the table, by the way? Is... 
All right, let's try this one. What do you know about Hulk Sanchez? He's a big jock on campus. Never dated him or anything. Have you seen any of those weird messages on the about, bulletin like, boards? She said she made a good point, and I'm asking so many yes, questions. Yes, and if I catch the guy who's doing it, he's going to be in big trouble. I bet it's the same person who keeps on setting off the soda machine alarm. I guess that comes with a territory of being a school monitor. Normally, it's not this hectic. When I figure out who's been pulling all these pranks, see you later. I did have Bye. the option to ask more about Haltenaka, and I didn't, and I hope that doesn't come to bite me in the butt later. Right, you. Do you know Connie Watson? Yes, we've been in a few classes together. I think she was dating Jake Rogers. <laughs> Connie told me you study too hard. Is that true? Connie doesn't know my study habits. I can handle my studies. I'm behind in my studies and I must get back to the <laughs> library. Bye, Nancy. <laughs> I can handle my studies. I'm behind in my studies. <laughs> Why can't I not? Why, what can, can you tell me about Daryl Gray? He's very popular and a good politician, too. Just like his father. Like his father? I hear he was a great politician, but not a very good businessman. I think his company went bankrupt a few years ago. Mm. Have you heard of Hulk Sanchez? Heard of him? Hulk holds the conference record for quarterback sacks. He's been the state's number one player since he was a freshman. He's also a candidate for a big university, even with his injury. Injury? His mouth is like Hulk got hurt a few weeks ago. Ever since that game, he hasn't played the same. I worry that his chances of playing for a top school are not as good as before his injury. I sprayed coffee everywhere. Oh no, I'm so sorry. Bye. <laughs> see you later, Nancy. Oh, see, he wasn't. He didn't dismiss me so quickly that time. I'm worried that they're gonna, like... Ooh! Oh, it's just a coin. I thought it was gonna be a note. I'm worried that, like, people are gonna, um, start being like, you ask a lot of questions and get really suspicious of me. Like, look, I am just, uh, what's, what's the um, phrase? Howdy-do, fellow kids! <laughs> that's, that's Nancy today. She had a Karen haircut and was staring into our souls. I'm just gonna really quickly... There we go. How's I, it going? I know he's there now. What can you tell me about Daryl Gray? There are three people in he the school. He seems like a cool guy. It. His family used to sponsor the annual football awards dinner until last year. You know, he's the one who found Jake's body. Daryl found Jake's body? I feel like this is important information that Daryl should have mentioned. But maybe he didn't want to be suspicious. He doesn't know I'm a cop. He doesn't have to not be suspicious to me. I'm not a cop. I'm from the FBI. I'm really sorry you got injured. Does that affect your chances of playing college ball? <laughs> I had a little sprain. She's so f I'm sorry to pause in the middle of his, his line, but he's just so funny. She's like, I'm so sorry you got injured. Here, speak into this recording device about how upset it's made you about <laughs> and whether it would make you commit a murder. <laughs> it's just so funny. Hey, no big deal. Within a week, I was better than before and impressing the football scouts. I'm as strong as ever. Do you know Hal Tanaka? That dude is always studying. He's a huge fan of mine. Real smart guy. But I never understood why a brain like Tanaka would hang out with slime like Jake. Oh, these clips are so good. Thank you. Hmm. Hal was a friend of Jake's? Let's just say I saw them talking together a lot. Jake's locker was right next to Hal's. But they weren't really friends. Is that what you're saying? Jake didn't really have friends, and Hal... He may seem pretty chill, but I've seen him crack a couple of times. He's seriously uptight. Crack a couple of times? He's got a temper, a bad one. He lets Ooh. the pressure build and build until he's wound so tight the slightest thing sets him off. Like last week, I strike him out during gym, and he goes ballistic and charges the mound. He's got some serious issues. I don't know any of these things. Mean. Now that I think of it, last time I saw them together, Hal seemed pretty upset. Uh-huh. What can you tell me about Connie Watson? She hangs out at the gym a lot. I heard she's been having a real tough time. I love how the characters all have these very limited stiff motions. It's like you're talking to a series of animatronics. I mean, earlier he just blinked. He's doing it again! When you don't speak to him, he just blinks at you. Was 
with the AC blaring so loudly. Oh, and it stopped. AC has, go has gone. <laughs> the AC's turned itself off again. It's so- I'm just gonna leave it. It's so unsettling. You can just watch this for a little bit. Is he actually blinking in a pattern? Let's watch. He's blinking every four seconds. Ish. Or is it every three? Yeah, it's every three. He's blinking every three seconds. <laughs> On the nose. He's resisting the urge to blink vertically. What? <laughs> Why do you think she hangs out at the gym so much? I don't know. She's a pretty good athlete, again. but never joined any of Paseo Del Mar's teams. Tough time? I heard she's been having some money problems. I'll talk to you later. Bye. Damn, some of these really get... How's it going? Ugh, okay, I've got to ask him. Later. Later. All right, well, now I guess i got to go back to either Hal or Connie and ask them what on earth is going on with that. But I think Connie is the... No, Hal's probably the closest, actually. Oh, okay, I can't ask him about See it. See you later, Nancy. He's like, can you imagine? She, like, runs into the room to talk to him and then doesn't say anything. Wait, where's the... I got myself lost. I think I have. Oh, that's the library. I hear she's been having some money problems. I want... Is the... Okay, the library and the study room are this way. So where is she? I was sure she was in, like, a side room. But now I can't find it anymore. Oh, this is a different there's two different like areas one's the library and one's the exit okay gotcha right i get lost in real life and in video games i have no sense of direction i need ah here we go this is where i want it to be hey nancy need something oh my god she's so no nosy didn't i hear you were dating jake hey a girl can make a mistake can't she Christ, he's dead! Everyone's so mean to this guy! Hope I'm told me so money's nosy. been tight for you these days. Oh, what a dork! Hulk Sanchez doesn't know the first thing about my life. He needs to get a life and stop talking about mine. She's so rude. You see, imagine how unsettling it would be to watch Nancy moving as if you were watching her. He blips forwards in roughly two meter increments and then rotates on naturally. <laughs> She's like, um... Oh, have you guys seen those um, videos, those TikTok videos where people like, it's clearly like a stop motion, but they like, like it looks like they're floating down the hall and they don't actually like move their feet at all. They're just like, mm, like that. I feel like that's what it looks like. She does that. Oh, but there's been no way to do <laughs> Maybe I should film that. That'd be funny. I'll let you go. Bye. Okay. I feel like I don't really have much more to do. Can I find their lockers? Probably not. That might not work. Oh yeah. <laughs> Did I leave? I don't know. I don't even know what I'm doing anymore. Oh, the soda machine alarm. Set off the oh. That was such a fake gulp. Like they, she, they didn't even record her drinking something. They just made her do a fake drinking sound. There's a weeping angel. How's it going? You blink and she suddenly was close. Oh go. no, she has a weeping See angel. Ya. Oh well, I mean it makes sense. All these guys are like. 
His hands are so small. I right, just keep mocking this guy's body like constantly. Okay. Right. I think it might be time to have a look in the library again because I feel like I've I don't have all the oh yeah the key forgot about the key. What time is it? Why are there all these people hanging out at school? And I have a ladle, but I don't know what that's for. Now, I know there's going to be some things that are references. I've already looked on these. I want to go to the computers. I wonder what I could look up a book on. Because I can look at the... That was intense. Don't have my books. How rude. Oh, it's Pasio. I've been calling it Pasco this whole time. Oh. Missing. That one's missing. Interesting. Interesting. I don't know if that's actually interesting. Hacking music, right? I have, okay, I have a code to log into the computer, but I, it, I can't get behind the desk. So I don't know what I'm missing. You can hear my mother in the other room gossiping with her friends on Zoom. Why, why, why I'm laughing so much? <laughs> what do they think you're laughing at? <laughs> Oh, they're just watching one of those Twitch streamers again. It's actually, um, speaking of ex talking about Twitch, I actually, uh, I think I maybe mentioned this story at the time, but when you're a streamer and somebody asks you what you do for a job, because this is basic, this is my job, um, well, I've got several, but this is one of my jobs. And when they ask you what you do for a job, and then you have to be like, right, how much, what level of explanation do I need to give to this person? Because some people you'll be like, oh, I stream on Twitch. And they're like, cool, I understand what that is. And some people you'll be like, so you know YouTube, <laughs> then you start there. You start at the YouTube explanation. If they don't know what YouTube is, then you have to go even like further back. Um, but I was once, I was recently on the phone with the internet providers that we use, but trying to get a better deal because our, um, our internet was not running fast. And I was like, we pay a lot of money and I don't really want to be paying this much money for internet that doesn't work. Um, and so I was like, hey, I'm planning on leaving. I wasn't, it was a lie, but it worked. Again, not good at lying, but I don't think they cared if it was a good lie or not. Um, and yeah this music is way too intense for this story by the way um and anyway like at one point he was like can i just ask like if you don't mind me asking why you use so much internet like you said you did you needed it for work can i ask what you do just because he was like looking stuff up and he was trying to pass the time i think and i was like oh i'm a twitch streamer and he went oh that's awesome and i was like oh thank god <laughs> so i don't need to explain um because most of the time it, i need at least to explain like a little bit but it's quite fun. Um, what kind of mu live investigating music is this? What books can we get read? What is that? I'm not gonna say that word because it, I think it'll end up as a swear word. Okay, uh, uh, this must be a reference. This surely can't be. This. I mean, if you have to explain to someone at your ISP what a Twitch streamer is. Well, I guess it depends where they are. My bank teller saw my sweatshirt, assumed I streamed, and proceeded to ask me if streaming was difficult. Just just go along with it. Just go along with it. Because if anyone ever asks you if you have to be good at gaming, it is, um... It then became a... a <laughs> I don't even know, Sketchy. It then became a conversation <laughs> of... <laughs> Thank you so much for that follow, Brune. Uh, I appreciate it. It then became a conversation of they only really watched like people who play league and i was like oh so i don't i don't 
I, I don't play that kind of game. Um, and I had to like explain. I was like, so I play puzzle games and I do cooking. And they were like, what? And I was like, yeah. Because uh, <laughs> like, cause, like, again, there's still the, do you know what YouTube is? I'm a Twitch streamer. And then there's, I'm a cooking streamer. <laughs> it's like, there's a lot of levels. Um, I told them they could sit on their couch and chat if they wanted. And being good at gaming isn't required. I mean, look at me. Not required. Itchy dough is an ancient, extremely simple yet highly effective form of hand-to-hand -hand combat. Although it is, in truth, nothing more than a repertoire of nine distinct, precisely to deliver defensive blows, Itchy dough can, when, ex sorry, laughing, when executed by a master, vanquish a foe in seconds. Itchy dough has never enjoyed great popularity, largely because the Itchy practitioner is required to proceed each move with a specific verbal salute, or chi cry. Once an adversary- Stop doing such exciting music! Once an adversary learns what a chi cry proceeds what blow, he of course can respond to each chi cry with appropriate block and thus defend himself indefinitely. Nevertheless, Ichido is still learned and practiced with great enthusiasm. Oh no, I didn't mean to close it. I hate this. I hate this so much. So there's different cries. Is that what she has around her neck? Is that the same thing? Does Connie know how to do itchy dough? I want to know what the original art for this part looks like in the in the non remastered version. Right, so somebody at some point is going to attack me and I have to remember which moves are which attacks. Okay, okay, hold on, hold on. Right, so... <laughs> I can't do this. Right, up left. Can I do like, should I just do a little grid? I think that's probably better. Up left is huzzah. <laughs> huzzah! Okay. Oh, this is hilarious. Right. Up right is ha 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 Up center is Essa. Mid left is Ika. Mid right is S. They just become a snake. Mid center is Shira. Low left is Kira. Kila. Lower right is Shaza. And low center is Chita. Which sounds like I'm swearing. Um, is that the only book I can open? Okay, good. Fantastic. What about over here? Gemstones, how to identify them. Quartz, amethyst. I mean, I can come back here at any time. So I think I wrote that down in case that becomes important and I can't really leave the fight to go and look this up. I'm pretty sure this is borderline offensive. I think it probably was. Let's be honest. That was the only book I need ever. Yeah. There's so many. Okay. So if we know there's a book about gems. We know there's a book about Mary Antoinette. Marie Antoinette, sorry. Uh, we know there's a book about... There's another book that I looked up in here. I'm sure there was. There's a, there's a Braille one, but I took a picture of that one. Yeah, I think that's all the books we can do in this bit. Now, last time we were here, I heard somebody run out the door and, like, set off an alarm. At least I thought I did. Chira, Chitara. Where did they get these attack names from? 80s cartoons? <laughs> Maybe. And I, again, I can't go behind the desk, which is really annoying because I have one of the first things I got was the login. Is that maybe at the house? I don't really understand. I thought it was in the library computers, but I can't get into those. Also, I hate the carpet. What's wrong with the carpet? Ah. 
We've left the room with the scary noises. Oh wait, I'm going the wrong way. How do I, how do I get out of here? I don't know how to leave. Get out of my house. Get out of my house. I want waffle fries. <laughs> Oh, I've just realized why she said it was the uh, the uh, soda alarm. I mean, the, the soda machine alarm. I'm pretty sure that that was... If, if I hadn't got the idea by then, that was my clue that the, the, the cryptic message was for the soda machine. Um, I can't answer that. Uh, without a legal representation. No, I can't answer that because um, uh, at, until yesterday, no, until Monday this week, me and Joe had a had a shared Spotify account. So I literally only have music from Monday. That's the, the, the first, I mean, obviously I have the music on his account, but like for my own personal Spotify song, Spotify rapped. It's not going to be correct. Right, can I tell this guy anything yet? Hi, Nancy. Ah! Oh. Bye, Uncle Steve. Goodbye. It's one of those carpets with a pattern that shouldn't be spread over a large area because it hurts your eyes. Grand, it's not the worst carpet crime of those sorts I've seen. That dubious honor goes to the carpet that used to be the hospital down in Dumfries, which had repeatedly bad clashing stripes of color. Ooh, gross. What would your 2021s? Probably something from inside. Going home. See if there's a computer in here somewhere. Nope. Okay. Wait, can I? Why can I not go any further than the corridor? I want to go upstairs. Can I? I can only get to the safe. I'm never going to want for money in this game. Unless there's something that it takes a lot of it. Did I go back and play some more Barnacle Blast? Already read that. Okay. Checking there's nothing I need to click on. I'm a bit lost. Not going to lie. I feel like I've spoken to everybody at the school. Maybe I need to go back to talk to Daryl. Oh no, I need to talk to Daryl about the fact that he found the body and didn't tell me that. My 2021 song would have been It's the End of the World as We Know It. Because you listened to it a lot or because it was indicative of the whole year. I think... What can I do for you? If we're going for one that sums up my year... Actually, my year wasn't too bad. Obviously, there were some things that happened that weren't the best. But I don't think it was that bad. It's been a song every year for the past five years. The kind of carpet that makes you want to vomit. Thankfully, at least it was in a hospital. Didn't I hear that you found Jake's body? Talking to this recorder. Yeah, I, I did. The student council president gets keys to the school. We had an early morning council meeting and I found him lying there. That's It was the suspicious. worst thing I ever experienced in my life. And I really don't want to think about it right now. And that is the appropriate reaction to finding a dead body, unlike all of the ones on TV shows. <laughs> talk to you later. Later. I really don't want to talk about it right now. Later. <laughs> cake. Can I have the cake, please? No? Okay, I'll just break into the kitchen again. I think I've already got everything I can get from in here. Unless I can steal a tomato. Oh, I can. Can I steal the knife? No. Can I steal a tomato? Why am I able to click on these? Ladle. Okay, no, it's not the ladle. Egg. Well, there's nothing on this actual screen I can... Oh, it says what? Wait, it says watch out here. Oh, yes. Never forget finding a dead body. Bye, Zs. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> that does not look clean. Health and safety violation. Okay. Oh, there's something at the bottom I hadn't noticed before. 
Now that looks less like an anagram. I don't know. I'm writing it down anyway. I took a picture of this, but is this like a really long what would Jesus do kind of thing? They're like it's the letters of it. Hmm, looks like something was removed here. Yeah, the corner of this. Oh, it says T E L three. Found another one. Yeah, there we go. I didn't even realize I'd had that one. Look at this mean. What does it mean? What does it mean? What does it mean? Ah. <laughs> it looks like someone already got to the first step to finding Jake's answer at Maxine's. What? That was a really cryptic way of writing your clue. Can't you just answer, write a clue nicely? Hi, Nancy. What? Bye-bye. I have stuff Be to careful. tell this guy. Why can I not tell him anything? Okay, so far this game has included a lot of talking to what people. What can I do for like, you? Like, more than normal. Talk to you later. Later. I've been in and out of this diner four times. Ooh. Oh, I've already looked at that. Yeah, it's the same one. Journal is my cash cow. So I really, really need to find that journal. Where am I gonna find it? Like, can I go in his locker? Oh, I can! Do I have anything that... I don't know if I really have anything that's... that's... Hmm. Okay, so all of the little codes that we've got are either L or R, so that makes me think that they're like left and right. So I'm wondering if at some point I'll be able to spell something. Oh no, one of them is a D. Never mind. Maybe it's down? Anyway, uh, let's try Jake. No wait, I can't do that because that's two digits. Ah. I did wonder if I was supposed to be able to find his locker, but I don't... Okay, let's have a look at what I have on my phone. Watch out. Got all sorts of stuff. Those are different colours, which I'm only noticing now. Hmm. Ooh! Steal a coin. Wondering if I can just guess and then I'll get in. <laughs> Sketchy, that's the thing that's annoying you. You can change the wallpaper, and I have. Something in the library? I just need four digits.
going through what I've got, nothing's... Okay. I'm gonna call, I'm gonna call my boyfriend, and I don't mean Joe. Hello? Is this Marte Windeglassen? Who is please calling me? Um, no. I'm trying to reach Ned Nickerson. Nancy, it's Ned. I, I thought with you being undercover and everything, I had to take on that <laughs> What a great guy. Ned, I'm the one who's undercover, not you. Okay, okay. I guess I'll just go undercover vicariously through you, which for some odd reason feels very deja vu-ish. It'd probably be a good idea if you didn't mention my assignment to anyone. You never know who may be related to this case, even up at Emerson. Your secret's safe with me, along with your heart. Oh, you're such a sweetie. Gross. Enough lovey-dovey talk. It'll make me miss you even more. So have you found any homicidal secrets yet? Bye. That's the answer. Bye, Ned. Off Wiedersehen. Oh my god, please never talk to me in German again. Okay, that's the only number I have. I'm just thinking, like, um, so, because Joe's going away, I just feel like I'm gonna phone him and he's gonna go, he's gonna do that exact line, and I'll be like, what? I'm not undercover. <laughs> you don't need to do this to me. Um. Go go for a date. So we've got X, E, T, E, Y, K, and C. Doesn't really... I'm sure that could make something, but... Someone has left a strange message on the bulletin board. Bonnie's medallion means crane. Oh! I already... I, I mean, I didn't figure that out. I don't like this. It told me this and I haven't figured that out yet. That's like... Aww. I, mm, I couldn't see her medallion, but I could tell that it had kanji on it. That's a bit annoying. Did I do crane? No. Anything past I requires two numbers, so that won't work. How do I... Like, I have her login, but I haven't been able to find a computer to log into. Am I doing something wrong? This is new. Grape, grape, orange, cool. We'll play the alarm in the school. ZRR4. Grape, grape, orange, cool. Okay. But he mangled that German phrase. It hurts me. I'm sure it hurt mo hurt mocks a lot more. X E R three. Oh, okay. Well, don't don't tell me yet. But that's good to know that somebody knows what they're doing, and it's not me. Let me just spin again. Bing. So intense. Ugh. He's so freaky standing there in the corner. Okay. So you got... Get Connie over here to fix it! Sorry, Connie. Why all the questions? What's going on with you, Nancy? Someone set off the alarm yeah, on the soda machine suspicious. again. <sighs> I'll be right back. I'm being horrible right now. Can you ever forgive me for what I did? I want to explain, but a part of me knows it's not safe and stupid to do. Sometimes I just can't keep it bottled up inside me and I want to scream it from the rooftops. Is this crazy? I'm not even saying this. I wish I had a better explanation so many times in the hallway we catch to the side and it seems like we both want to say something but just keep walking. Is that it? Is that all I get from setting off the alarm? Like one thing? 
taking pictures. Someone set it off. Definitely wasn't me. Oh, wrong way. That new girl told me you said I'm having money problems. So what if I did? You're such a loser. Don't ever use that word to refer to me. Oh no. Get out of my face, Hector. Hector! What are you going to do? Ow! Ow, ow! Connie, stop it! I don't want you to You have them. an attitude problem. I was gonna help. Later. I was trying to help. How's it going? I gotta go. <laughs> Bye. Like he hasn't just like whatever she was doing to him like i don't know pulling his ear just totally chill about it. like hey how's it going <laughs> what's up hmm. okay i have decided that we're gonna take a little break by that I mean I'm going to end the stream in a second but not yet not yet because we're going to the diner and we're gonna try and play that game again and I'm gonna try and get through it we're gonna play barnacle last um and then once I finish this, we'll wrap up the stream so I can say goodbye to Joe. And then we'll come back tonight and we'll play something non-PG because it's non-PG night. And then I'll probably play more of this tomorrow because I haven't got any baking to do. So we'll do an extra stream. Sound good? I don't know what we're playing tonight, by the way. I have a couple of options, but I haven't picked anything. Right, here we go. Let's save first. So bad. Barnacle Blast! Barnacle Blast! That's what I was trying to do. I was trying to get you to go in between them. Why are there police sirens? I don't know. Oh! Ah! Uh, ah! <laughs> oh, I'm gay. I'm doing this really badly now. Oink. 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 Are we saying that Sketchy set off the alarm, yeah? We're blaming Sketchy? I'd like to say, well, I'm doing this. You win. Uh... I'd like to say a quick thank you to those who are new or have been here for a long time and keep coming back and enjoy my content and consume my content. Consume. Um, whoa. Um, regardless of what I'm playing. And, you know, obviously there's nothing wrong with having a preference, oh god, for certain content and there's nothing wrong with that, but it's just also really nice to know there are some people who will come and watch whatever is play being played. Nancy Drew, Back for Blood, um, other games that I play, Pokemon, there we go, or what was that I played yesterday? Potion Craft, you know, nice. Oh, just saved that, that was a, that was touch and go, that was a clutch move. I need to get you over to the left, dude. Aw, I forgot, I thought the treasure, no, oh, that sucks. Oh, oh my god. Whew. I'm only here for the pong. Like away for a minute when suddenly we're playing breakout. Obviously. It's the only kind of breakout I like. Today's stream is sponsored by Spot Stars. Because the only kind of breakout I like is on an arcade machine. Whoa. 
so um yeah this is actually we st we started playing this very early on and i got to level nine and i almost beat level 10 and someone in the chat said that they re vaguely remember there being some kind of achievement for getting a certain amount of levels but they don't know how many it was and i think it makes sense that it's 10 but we're just going off an assumption here because you know 10 is a nice round number come on baby I haven't actually looked at what the number is whenever I get a new life, but I'm assuming it's like a nice, like, I don't know, 5,000 or something. Come on, yay! Exactly. Famed investigator Nancy Drew ignoring the murder, the literal murder. This is the first time we've played a Nancy Drew and there's actually been a murder. Oh, oh, I almost lost that. The chests, the treasure chests make the paddle bigger. The anemonemones, which is what's there in between the red ones, make the pa the uh, balls slower and the whirlpools make it faster. But I'd like to avoid the whirlpools because this is about as fast as I can, I can take. Uh, I will read the chat in a second. You know, it slowed down. Also, a quick disclaimer that whenever the music starts up, it does uh, sometimes, not actually, not every time, it will sometimes lag the game for like a split second, so I can't move my paddle or the ball like jumps across the screen. Uh, but it doesn't do it every time, so it's not something I can pr predict is going to happen. But also, the music hasn't been restarting. Annoyingly, the most recent uh, Nancy Drew game. I moved it just out of the way, just at the end. You have inspired me to stop procrastinating and stream today, so thank you. You're welcome. I hope your stream goes well. There's the music. The stream has been brought to you by Clearasil for when you're faced faced with a breakout. Not sponsored, please sponsor us. Hashtag non spons. This is one of those games that's old enough that you had to VM it. No, no, no. This is actually remastered. Uh, ah! Oh my god, that was horrible. Uh, this is the remastered version. God. Stop talking. I just can't talk. Full concentration. Super strong diluted juice. It's full concentration. No, no water here. Stop talking! I keep moving a little bit too early and I thinking I'm gonna swing it and I end up oh <sighs> they are all on steam this I got I finally caved and got the classic bundle instead of individually buying them which is what this one's on they don't I couldn't I mean I didn't really look very hard but it's easier to find this version than the original Because it's the remastered version that does mean there's a lot of references to the games that were made before it that before they remastered this one and i haven't played all of them okay i'm doing really bad we may have to restart this but i have enough ah god i have enough quarters we can do it this is like me in the last game not knowing what a nickel and a dime were so confused This is just getting ridiculous now. Trying. There we go. No! There we go. Come on! Oh no! So close! So are you going to be streaming? Sorry. Yes! 
I have one life. 80 and. a way to get all of them without it landing. Ah! Oh no, we still have one more go. We have one more go. Now kind of want to watch Joe and Lara play Mario Tennis for some reason. I don't. I don't think that's a good idea. <laughs> Genshin, my my addiction doesn't allow me to play anything else. Is Genshin good? I know a lot of people who play, who stream it, but I've never actually watched a stream with it. We're starting again. watch. I'm gonna have such a high- Yes! I'm gonna have such a high playtime on this game. It's all just from playing Barnacle Blast. Like, the murderer gets away, you know, they finish high school. Nancy's dad's like constantly calling her and being like, where are you? What's going on? We've got this team. Oh, so close to hitting that chest. Yes, fantastic. song back on. One more, come on. Yes. Okay. I liked Genshin but found the dungeons really dull and repetitive. Everything else I really enjoyed. Yeah, it demands us for grinding mats. I didn't understand half those words. I catch the block of my monitor. Oh no. I think my favorite variation on the breakout formula that I've ever played is Jardinanes? It's breakout but with a cheeky garden gnomes popping up to sabotage you. Beautiful. Beautiful. I'm gonna become a breakout champion. You just do watch. My next hyperfixation. said this beat goes hard, they're not wrong.
I, I don't know, Sketchy. I can't answer that. I actually prefer it being slower, honestly. And the music stopped again. I swear that is kind of a pet peeve of mine. It's when a game's a game's music will just stop and then it won't come back. Like at least this this time it's kind of coming back now and then. But I think it's only when I put I actually like click something that it comes back. It seems to be when I get like a next level and I have to start again, that's when the music starts again. Come on! Yes! Just one more. So close. There we go. It's every 80,000. Okay, what is with the 80? It must be like an 80th anniversary because there have been three things with 80 on them. The level had 80. There's now eight, every 80,000 you get an extra ball. The oh, Hulk's jacket has an 80 and there was another 80 that I've forgotten about already. Cat IT. Have you tried turning it off and on again? Never mind, I'll do it for you. There was a revenge for me dragging him out of bed. 10 minutes under a bed 10 minutes ago oh no clearly the composer thought to themselves damn it i paid good money for this huge collection of samples and god help me i'm gonna use them this is a detective game right we can put police sirens in it that makes sense the detective's an 18 year old she's not actually a detective that's fine we'll still do it anyway who cares about logic I kind of spaced out there and I wasn't really paying attention. Welcome to the stream where we just play Breakout. One second! I think I can pause it while we're doing this. Cannot pause right now, sorry. And one more. Come on, come on. We've got to get it. Joe's waiting at the door. He wants to talk to me. What is it? Come on, come on, come on. Ellen might have been playing this the whole time. Oh no! That's the first ball I've lost. Come in! Come in! He's oh, gone. Yes, um, I was gonna, I was gonna, um, stop the stream early, so. We'll be here for. Okay, that's what I'm aiming for. I'm aiming for just beforehand. Put stuff in it. I do. Ooh. Hold on, let me show. Oh, I'm just it. So, I'm away off to our wedding. Um. <laughs> oh. Um, yeah, there's been a bit of a, a scare. Um, and I thought, what better? Than to use the Christmas present I got last year, um, and I'm taking a, my hip flask. Um, <clears throat> it's a, a wonderful little hip flask that was uh, given to us by our Adeen. Cute. Got sloshes in it. Got sloshes in it. 
Um, I have used the cherry and chocolate one. Oh, gel. Wait, straight? Yes. Ooh. Is that what you're supposed to do? I don't know. Yeah, you, it's just for holding the spirit because oh. that way you can either take a nip or you can Put it in something. add it. I guess you're not going to get that. Like at the, exactly, that's yeah. why I'm taking it. Yeah, like it means any fancy. Sorry, I kind of spaced out for the moment. I wasn't paying attention. And that was the day that chat knew for certain that Lara, while being a lovely person overall, could not be trusted to babysit anyone's child. No. I just end up being like, why is it screaming at me? Oh, goodbye, honey. I'll see you in a bit. So yeah, he's going away for a few days. So I'm, uh, that's why I'm going to stop the stream early so I can say goodbye. And then we'll start nighttime stream and run it for longer. If that's cool with everyone, once I've had food, I'll go make myself some food and then we can start the nighttime stream. Anyway, back to the game for now. That was, and I didn't want to say anything until it had happened, that was the first ball I'd actually lost this playthrough. <laughs> so difficult. Okay. Oh my god. Is it faster? Oh, I was gonna say, is it faster or is it just me? My parents are away, so I'm having like a house party. They want to bring the solo cups. We're gonna play beer pong, except it's just this game. There's no actual beer involved. Ah, no, <laughs> so close. Okay, now I, I was getting cocky. Okay, stop talking. That's kind of the how things are going. If I just shut up. Joe's cursed me. He's ruined my run. Again, spaced out. Sorry. I'm thinking that barnacle's an eye. Oh my god, are you joking? <laughs> Partay at the flat! Yeah. Partay. Come on. No! 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 I was hoping to avoid those again. It happened again. Oh my god. Okay, but at least now it's not gonna be super fast. I wonder if there's an exact place you can aim it to get all of them in one shot without it bouncing. Oh, I really thought I was going to hit something. The way the music ends just kills me. <laughs> yeah, it's a bit abrupt. I can get- oh no! I want this on my Spotify. Okay, 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 level eight. Why is it lasers and like, I see what you mean about the sound person just being like, let's just use all the sound effects. Ah, okay, stop talking.
it froze. I was trying to move and it just, it didn't let me move. Oh my God, are you joking? It's an Easter egg. You will think it's weird and I'm reveling in the nostalgia. I'm assuming, yeah. You said it was an Easter egg. It must be from another game, but now I'm intrigued. Oh my God. So it turns off and it's silent. Yep. I just realized I just remembered another 80. The combina combination? The combination? The combination to Jake's locker was set at 80 80. I just have to get through this level. Please, Lord, let me get through this level. I'm going silent, okay? Like, properly, I'm not gonna talk. I'm just gonna concentrate. <laughs> I knew that was gonna happen. As soon as I said I had to concentrate, I was like, I'm gonna drop it. I take one more step. This is the furthest I've ever been from the Shire, Mr. Frodo. Do I have to do 80 levels or something horrible? of how this ends we're gonna stop bigger no this must be a set size that's annoying i was hoping it would go like the whole screen no okay on baby i was leaving soon i don't want to be playing this very well <laughs> and he's like I have to go now and I'm like, I can't pause it. I'm in the middle of a level. He's like, I'm literally getting in the car. I'm like, no, please. Game really likes the number 80, which makes me think it must have. I mean, when was that you written? It was in the 1930s. So 80 years on would be 2010. That kind of makes sense. Was it written in the 1930s? I assumed it was, but maybe it wasn't. Hmm. 
Come on. I could see it was heading that way. Yes. Okay. It's my last turn. Oh, not anymore. Just enjoy watching it. Oh! Damn it. Okay, this is my last try now because I got another ball there at the time. I go pretty far. I go pretty far. Okay. And with that. With that, we're going to end the stream. I am going to say a proper goodbye, but for if you're watching this later on the highlight, thank you so much for watching. I'll be back soon with more Nancy Drew.